Hello and welcome to the news button. Delhi got a modern and futuristic international exhibition come convention center which will boost conference tourism in India. The economic and tourism related benefits of the center will also be multifold. The Bharat Mandapam inaugurated by PM Narendra Modi is a statement of India's aspirations as much as its capabilities. It expresses the approach of think big, dream big, act big. As the nation prepares for the G20 summit, it will demonstrate that India is ready for the world. Bharat Mandapam, which will host the much awaited G20 summit in September under India's presidency, will promote conference tourism. While inaugurating, Prime Minister Modi said, the world will witness the rising stature of India when newly built Bharat Mandapam will host the G20 summit. The revamped IECC complex was developed as a national project at a cost of about 2700 crore. It has a campus area of approximately 123 acres. It is said to host the G20 summit which will be attended by heads of states of G20 nations, including the US, the UK and China. The IECC complex is now India's largest meetings, incentives, conferences and exhibitions destination. In terms of the covered space available for events, the complex finds its place among the top exhibition and convention complexes in the world today. Prime Minister Modi unveiled the name of the world-class convention center in the heart of the national capital through a drone in the presence of Union Commerce Minister Pius Goel and other ministers. The way Modi chose to inaugurate the magnificent center is a telling statement of his government's thrust on technological progress and leveraging India's tech prowess to every governmental functions during the inauguration, the Prime Minister called the redeveloped complex a wonderful site and said that Bharat Mandapam will serve as a gateway to global opportunities. Modi also utilized the occasion to blow the bugle for the 2024 elections. He presented a blueprint for a third term of his government. He pledged that in his third term, India will become the third largest economy in the world with a faster growth rate than the present. The Modi government tenure comes to an end in May. The PM sought a third term on the development plank. Modi said that when his government took office in 2014, the Indian economy was at the 10th position and now it is at the 5th position in the world. He said that India will be one of the top three economies in the world during his third term. Hope you liked the video. Before leaving, leave your comments in the comment section and do not forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching.